Today we're going to talk about limestone. I've noticed a lot of people in pet keeping hobby don't know where to get limestone and how to identify it. In aquarium hobby it's considered as a welcome addition to the terrariums, while in aquarium hobby it's considered a hazard. Limestone and dolomite are both calcium rich stones and behave pretty much the same. As an alternative supplement you can always use cured Portland cement, calcium oxide. Limestone is one of the most common stones around the world and most common problem is how to properly identify it. First method, smell. Limestone smells a bit rotten when a new surface is exposed when you break it, but this smell is very subtle and quite unreliable. Second metal, steel scratch. Limestone is very brittle. If you try to scratch something like steel with it, it's going to leave a mark you can wipe off and won't damage steel. This method is not 100% reliable, but I've mostly used this method in the past. Third method, acid test. This is the one that most people are unsure how to do, asking where to get acid and the like. There is a very cheap solution that exists in every household, vinegar. For this presentation I will use alcoholic vinegar, because it's transparent and you will see the reaction clearly. You can also use something like grape vinegar. First I'm going to pour some vinegar in the glass. And put a bit of limestone inside. After a while it will start to bubble. Let's keep that. After a couple of minutes you will notice the chemical reaction that is occurring between the vinegar and limestone. This is shown in the form of bubbles. Now I'm going to show you the same thing with the cement. A bit of vinegar. And a bit of cured cement. The reaction is quite more rapid with this one, but you can see the chemical reaction quite easily. I hope I have provided you with enough information on how to identify limestone. Feel free to subscribe to my channel for future videos.